you have unused school supplies, you can turn them into the blue donation bins in the cafeteria during lunch. Interested in running cross country? The boys cross country team will host an interest meeting today at 6 p.m. in the LHS Little Theater. Scan the QR code to receive reminders this week through the Sports U app. If you have any questions, contact Coach Oxley at soxley at lexington1.net. If you have signed up to take Ivy Literature next year and did not receive an email from Ms. Small with the summer reading assignments, please stop by room D108 sometime this week to pick up your assignment. The popular Fast and Furious franchise came out with the 10th movie, Fast X. It was released on May 19th of this year and is expected to gross over $18 million on just the first day. The much anticipated movie was supposed to be released in 2021, but was postponed due to COVID-19. The new villain, played by Jason Mimosa, seeks revenge on the team from back in the seventh movie when they caused him to crash off a bridge and run into water. Returning characters Dominic Toretto, Letty Ortiz, On the Way, and more are continuing their fight to overcome the next challenge. Overall, Fast X has many unexpected twists and challenges, which will make a great movie. If you're interested in joining Mock Trial, please reach out to Liliana Heaton at LilianaHeatonB at Lexington1.net or message her on Instagram for more information. Juniors, please check your email for a message with a link to sign up for senior pictures. This picture will be in the yearbook. There are still yearbooks available for purchase. They are $110, cash or check payable to LHS. Come to room C103 if you want to purchase a yearbook. I was really surprised. Um, actually, when I won, um, they normally I'm the one filming all of these videos, and so I kept asking, like, hey, where are we going? Who, whose hallway are we going to do um, film? Um, and they wouldn't really answer me. But anyway, so I turned the corner, and I was just, like, really surprised to see everybody out there. I'm really thankful to everyone who voted for me. Um, again, it's amazing. Um, I appreciate uh, people seeing what I do and appreciating that, and it, it was awesome. So I've had Ms. Miller for three years now, and the second I met her, she was instantly my favorite teacher. Um, I've never met a more caring teacher in my life, and she's to say she's deserving is an understatement. The second that I found out that she was nominated, I immediately knew she was going to win because Ms. Miller does everything for the school, and I'm so happy for her um, because she doesn't just care about her students, she cares about all the students in the school. Ms. Miller has really made my past two years here at the school feel like a place where like I belong. I it's helped me as a person so much, just like my self confidence and just who I am as a person and she's really formed me and she definitely deserves to win teacher of the year. Miss Miller um, is a really great teacher. She definitely does a lot for the school. Um, I'm ver I'm very happy for her for winning teacher of the year. She loves every single one of her students. I'm really thankful to everyone who voted for me. Um, again, it's amazing. Um, I appreciate uh, people seeing what I do and appreciating that, and it, it was awesome. Empower teachers, please go over the final exam schedule with your students. Exams must be taken and cannot be taken early. They are 20% of your grade. That's all for today. Have a great day, Wildcats.